why do customers complain? Well, before you answer that question, I'm going to challenge you. I personally believe that customers complain, the majority of customers complain, because they are loyal. Let me explain. If you've lived in Southeast Asia or China, you've probably traveled a lot in taxis. Um, in my 12 to 13 years living in China, I've probably taken thousands of taxis. And I have had a large number of bad experiences. I dare say 20, 30 bad experiences during that time. In one case, um, my driver, the taxi driver, stopped in the middle of a highway and reversed because he missed the turn off to the, uh, to the airport. That's how bad the customer service has been in taxis in my experience. But throughout all those bad experiences, and some of them quite dangerous, how many times have I formally complained? How many times have I picked up the phone or sent an email or even gone and visited the office to, com to make a formal complaint? Well, the answer is zero. I've never made a formal complaint regarding a taxi. And the reason for that is that there are literally 40, 50,000 taxis in Shanghai alone. The chance that I'll ever meet the same taxi driver again is next to none. I'm very unlikely going to meet the same driver again. So there's really no means, no, no reason for me to make a formal complaint. It's going to fall on deaf ears. It's going to have no effect. But when do I complain? Well, I do complain when the restaurant down, my, down the road from my office and my home um, give me bad service or the food isn't as, as uh, up to standard as it's usually up to standard. Or if the beer's warm, for example, next door, uh, the restaurant that I go to. The reason I complain in these cases is because I'm loyal. I recently made a complaint to an airline, one that I hold a loyalty card to. And I made a very long uh, email, wrote a very long email, uh, outlining the bad customer service that I felt that I had experienced. And I got a reply. Now, if I didn't, write a complaint, if I didn't send a formal, invita uh, formal complaint, then it's probably because I'm using the competitor. You see, customers who complain are loyal. They want to come back. Customers who don't complain, well, they don't care because they're using the competitor. They're using another company. So it doesn't matter why they complain. There's no reason. It's just a waste of their time. So the next time that you receive a complaint, Rather than feel sad and unhappy and frustrated, feel happy because standing before you or in the email or on the phone is a self-described loyal customer. So rather than say, which we always do, sorry, we should say thank you. If someone came up to you and said, hi, I'm very loyal to your brand, you wouldn't say sorry, you'd say thank you. So the next time someone complains, you say thank you for bringing this to our attention. Thank you for making this complaint. Thank you for helping us improve. Thank you for being a loyal customer. Now that you see complaints in a different way, I'm sure your customer service team will be much more grateful for those horrible and angry phone calls.